What's good, y'all? your boy Ross back at again with another video. So I'm gonna check out why did Crime Time never win the WWE Tag Team Titles? This is actually from JTG's actual YouTube uh, channel. So uh, some of y'all had linked it to me in the Discord, so I wanted to check it out. Um, that is a very good question on why they never won. They were an over group. Yes, they fit the stereotype of black people, but they were hilarious and they were still over but they never put the titles on them so it, 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 i want to know from his perspective why they never put the titles on them also rest in peace to uh shag gaspard man um his situation was very tragic and it was very unfortunate to hear that news a few years ago so uh rest in peace to him man um let's get right into this video let's see what jtg has to say about his time in wwe so there are three occasions, three that I know of, where Crime Time was supposed to win the World Tag Team titles. Three occasions. One time in 2007, another time in 2008, and another time in 2009. Damn. If there were more occasions where we were supposed to win, that's beyond my knowledge, but I'm going to tell you from what I heard. Damn. The first time Crime Time was supposed to win the World Tag Team titles was in 2007 at a pay-per-view. I can't remember the pay-per-view. I know you guys, the fans, would know the pay-per-view, so please leave it in the comments. But it was after a South Africa tour in September. I was told uh, when we came back uh, from our six-month release, because we were released oh, uh, damn. For, a, uh, for putting our hands on the ref. If you want the details, you got to get the book. Um, I'll probably leave the link in the in the description. But we were supposed to work Lance Cade and Trevor Murdoch the whole South African tour. Oh, uh, I remember back, them we as the tag team titles uh, at the pay per view. That was one occasion. The second time Crime Time was supposed to win the World Tag Team Title, or actually, not from what I've heard, I heard it straight from the horse's mouth, uh, was in October two thousand eight. We had a match the week prior on Raw, and we had uh, some disagreements with the current champions. And because of those disagreements over a spot, uh, one of the champions came up to me the, the same day and said, we were supposed to drop the titles to you, but you know, he pulled me to the side. He said, we creative decided to change it because of- Wow. Uh, the disagreement that we had over a spot. Are you serious? Wait a minute, wait a minute. So you telling me they they canceled the push of y'all getting the title for the second time because of a disagreement over a spot? Ah, uh, if that don't reek of politicking, I don't know what does. That, sh that reeks of politicking, bro. And the following week, the champions drop the titles to Kofi and CM Punk. Wow! The third time Crime Time was supposed to win the World Tag Team titles was in 2009 at SummerSlam. It was Crime Time versus Jericho. That's actually one of my favorite matches of all of my entire career. Even though we didn't win the titles, that's still one of my favorite matches. Cause I remember that. My Them, new that tag team. That was at the Staples Center. And it was against Big Show and Chris Jericho, who I have so much respect for. The pinnacle of professionalism and who you should inspire to be if you want to be a professional wrestler. Chris Jericho is, is the man in the locker room, respected in and out. But I digress. <laughs> um, we didn't win the titles, and I was told uh, later on from Creative that they decided to keep the titles on Jericho because they wanted them to work a feud with DX. A few months later, uh, Jericho dropped the titles to DX in a TLC match, Damn. which was a very good match. But uh, I, you know, just, just coming from me, I think a feud with Crime Time and DX. That's where the money would have been. Ooh, the backstage segments. Yeah, nah, that that shit actually would have been that 
that would have been entertaining because they've had backstage segments and it was hilarious bro i think that would have been entertaining in my personal opinion the chemistry on the mic going back and forth yeah i would have gave Shawn michaels a run for his money he didn't want the, he didn't want that smoke but he got what you got <laughs> There are a few more occasions where Crime Time was supposed to win the tag team titles. Those three stood out the most. But to be honest with you, we didn't need them. I'm looking back at my career, and when we started in 2006, we were one of the fastest up and yeah. rising tag teams, the most popular during our era. Yeah. Go back and, and look at the archives. Crime Time during 2006 to 2009 was one of the most popular tag teams in, in they were bro even though they were just a huge ass stereotype they were over it worked yo 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 bro oh it, it was just a huge stereotype but it worked it was entertaining they were over they were but as you can see it's it's Politicking at his finest, bro. That sucks, bro. What the fuck? In WWE history. And we didn't need the titles for that. Looking back, there's been champions, tag team champions. There have been superstars that have been put together to be tag team champions. And you guys would never remember them. This is true. remember crime time. Yes, this I is true. I have no regrets or quarrels about my career. Looking back, I had an amazing tag team career. And I wouldn't trade it for anything. Crime Time will always will be remembered as the uncrowned champions. Mm -hmm. And to me, as long as they were, we're remembered, that's all that's important to me. So all the fans that keep asking me why we were never tag team champions, there you go. I give you three instances where we were supposed to win, but because of disagreements, politics, there we go. Um, better storylines, you know, things happen the way they happen. And hey, it is what it is. But Crime Time will always will be remembered for one of the most popular tag teams in WWE history. Cheer. Damn, man. That's crazy. And that was why Crime Time never won the tag team titles. If you have any matches where you thought Crime Time was this close to winning the titles and I didn't talk about it, Leave it in the comments. I'll be sure to get back with you. Like, subscribe if you haven't already, and stay tuned for more episodes with the God. Wait for it. Wait for it. Chill. Ah, oh, man, bro. That's crazy. <laughs> Yo, that that is that is crazy. I did not know that. I'm going to go ahead and give this a like, man. Go ahead, subscribe to JTG, man. If y'all haven't already, go ahead, show JTG some love. One half of Crime Time. Once again, rest in peace, Shag Aspert, man. Uh, that's that's very interesting. I love to see now more wrestlers are getting into YouTube and telling their side of their career, and it, it's it it peels back that layer of what really goes on in the wrestling business and the biggest company biggest wrestling company in the world so comment down below let me know what was your favorite crime time moment man what was your favorite crime time moment whether it was a promo a match segment doesn't matter y'all let me know what was your favorite crime time moment of all time i appreciate all love and support road to 150k appreciate y'all kicking it with me see you next one peace